Shiv Army, welcome back to the channel. Appreciate you guys for being here with us. We've got a lot to talk about in this video as it relates to the ecosystem. And there's a very surprising piece of news that Shiba Inu is endorsing a $100 million market cap crypto right now. And they're saying that it could get into the billions. So stick around to the end of the video for that. But let's get into the overall market here, guys. This is a big, big week for SHIB and the entire ecosystem. We're watching K9 Finance pump right now. We have ETH Toronto. We're getting ready to head to the conference. Guys, take a look at this view. Uh, pretty epic uh, right outside me there. And uh, we are getting ready to head over to the conference. Now, here's the thing. SHIB is another official sponsor this year, lead sponsor. They did this last year too. Bone 3X last year during this conference. SHIB had a nice little pump. Again, they announced Shibarium last year, which was a big deal, obviously. And then uh, we also got a little bit of a boost from Bad Idea AI. Bad Idea AI actually went on a parabolic run right after this conference last year. I think it went to like $150 million market cap or something like that. But now we have K9 Finance out there that's liquid staking. That is an official SHIB partner. They are a lead sponsor this year. So we're expecting some big news out of that. And we might even have some other, not official partners, but partners of SHIB that are going to be at the conference this year. We're going to get into all of that in this video. All right, so SHIB right now is uh, down about 3%, sitting at $8 billion market cap, ranked number 13. The rest of the market pretty flat right now. We're down about 1%. If we take a look at Bone right now, I think there's still a ton of undervalued, a uh, ton of undervalued, uh, basically, cryptos right now, and especially within the SHIB ecosystem, Bone is one of those, uh, sitting now at like 42 cents right now. Uh, we dip down below to 38 cents. We dip down below all the way actually to 33 cents earlier this month. Uh, getting Bone here down here at 42 cents right now, I think is a steal. Uh, when we look at, you know, this is the governance token of the ecosystem now. Uh, we're hitting low points that we haven't seen here in the last 12 to 15 months. So definitely, definitely a good opportunity here. Uh, on the all chart, Bone is down 99% from its all-time high. This is, I think, a great opportunity. Leash, very similar situation over here. And we're looking at all of these right now as potential cryptos that could pump during the conference, guys. Again, SHIB's a big part of ETH Toronto. We're talking about the largest ERC-20 crypto in SHIB. They have a big presence here. I was there last year. They dominate this conference. So a lot of chatter is gonna be happening and a lot of news is gonna be breaking I think throughout the week, uh, you know, so, so, some things maybe pump the charts more than others as a leash right now sitting down here just below $300. Keep in mind, leash got up to 9,000 at the peak in the previous all time high. So this is what I wanted you to stick around for because this is interesting. So everything's pretty much down within the official SHIB tokens right now, down, you know, a little bit, which is good because I think we got room to pump here. But there is one token that SHIB has kind of unofficially and officially endorsed. And I've talked about it since it was like a one, $2 million market cap. You guys have probably heard me talk about it before. And that is Kendu Inu. Now, keep in mind, the SHIB dev team has, again, discussed this. Shaitoshi was following this main account when there was like 300 people on their Twitter page, which is insane. Also keep in mind that they have some surprise that they're going to be announcing and how they're going to be adding something to the Shibarium ecosystem. So Shiba Inu highlights the token that could become the first meme coin to hit a hundred billion dollar market cap. Uh, and you must be wondering, wait, what? A hundred billion? Yes. That is Kendu Inu's big goal. I mean, they have big dreams, big goals, obviously trying to get to a hundred billion, but according to a blog post, Shiba Inu, the official source, uh, the official dev team noted that Kendu, which initially launches a meme coin, aims to clinch the $100 billion valuation. It started that Kendu planned to achieve this aim by focusing on the NFT space following the launch of Kendu Chad's NFT marketplace. Interestingly enough, though, SHIB characterized this move as a bold step. The blog post also talked about Kendu's approach, prioritizing community driven values over rapid growth. This is also reflected in Kendu's recently launched NFT marketplace, which adopts a revenue sharing model benefiting Kendu holders. So here's the big story here. Can Kendu get to 100 billion? God only knows. 
Do we need it to get to 100 billion in order to make a lot of money with Ken Dewey New? No, and especially if you were early to this asset. Do I think it can get into the multi-billions here with SHIB backing it? 100%. 100 billion, again, God only knows. Would be great, I'm not gonna bank on that. But saying that it could get to a billion first, which we're 10X away from that, and then into the billions, there's still a ton of opportunity for, for growth here with Kendu. Now, I'm curious to see if they're gonna have a presence here at ETH Toronto. I hadn't heard anything. I'll keep you guys posted on that. And I'm gonna be broadcasting, putting out videos all week long for you guys. So make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Make sure you're locked in with notifications on because there's gonna be a lot of things happening uh, throughout the week related to SHIB, but also outside of SHIB, things that I find interesting that we'll be talking about right here on the channel. So make sure you guys are definitely, definitely locked in. A couple other things to round things out before we close up the video. If you haven't hit the like button, definitely do that. If you have not subscribed, definitely do that as well. But if we take a look at some of the uh, top gainers right now, again, pretty flat across the market, but we have seen a couple layer ones start to move a little bit. Uh, Sui is one of those. Casp was starting to move a little bit today. Uh, on, honestly, other than that, there's not much brewing in the overall markets. Uh, SHIB, as we mentioned here, if we take a look at the price points here on SHIB, let's pull it up and uh, give you guys a quick glance there. Uh, we've been consolidating essentially here, uh, basically for about a week now, since we came back down on August 11th when the overall market pulled back. Been trading sideways, good opportunity I think to accumulate here for the long term. Same thing could be said here for a lot of uh, top altcoins within crypto right now. But uh, yeah, we're sitting at the 1365 level. All the technical indicators, guys, flashing sell signals because we have not been able to get above some of the key moving averages. We're still a ways away here from reclaiming our 200 day, which I believe is the most important because it takes in the most data, right? When we're looking at the 200 day moving average, we get the best idea of where the price is. And the 200 day moving average right now for SHIB, four zeros, 2044. So we got to get back to the twos right now in order to claim that 200 day moving average. We're a ways away from there, sitting at the 1364 right now. Uh, but again, this week could be big. I mean, we could get there literally in hours, depending on what this news is, how the market responds to it, how big the news is. We need Shibarium burn portals freaking live. We've been waiting too damn long and we need that live. I hope that that's an announcement this week or at least some indication. I believe it was in SHIB Magazine not too long ago. Lucy had talked about that it's coming. Enough of that, enough of the it's coming talk. We need it out live now because that's gonna be an incentive for people to use Shibarium. Right now, unless you're building on Shibarium, unless you're a project on Shibarium, right? Or you're just absolutely infatuated and in love with the ecosystem, you have no incentive to use Shibarium. If you want a normal folk, a normal person, to actually utilize Shibarium, give them an incentive. An incentive would be to burn Shiba Inu because everybody and their brother holds SHIB. They can literally contribute to the price going up. Everybody wants to see price go up. Get the burn mechanism live. Again, I'm not on the dev team. I can't you know, snap my fingers and make this happen, but this would be a big announcement. So who knows, maybe we get that at the conference here. No matter what, we'll be covering it for you guys. As you guys know, we talk about everything here on the channel. Uh, and keep it real with you. So make sure you do subscribe down below. Appreciate you guys. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.